Persia, a long, long time ago, lived Mordecai and his cousin Esther. Hello, my name is Esther, and I am Jewish. I live in Persia, and I am fierce. Go, Esther! Go, Esther! Go, Esther! Hey, guys, have you heard? Queen Vashti was banished for disobeying the king, and now there's a countrywide audition to be the king's new queen. I'm so nervous. They don't know I'm Jewish, and I'm not going to bring it up. Go, Esther! Go, Esther! Go, Esther! Morty was right. I totally won. It's cool being queen. I have beautiful things. But I'm lonely being cut off from all my real friends. Mordecai is coming to visit me today. I want to run and greet him, but that Haman dude, the prime minister, is downstairs. There's something not quite right about that guy. Can't put my finger on it. Finally, Morty arrives. Are you okay? And Morty tells me the most horrible words my ears have ever heard. Everyone was ordered to bow down to Haman, and everyone did except him, and Haman flipped out. Now Haman has convinced the king to declare that on the 13th of the month, the Jews will all be killed. I knew there was something about that, Haman. I need to start trusting my instincts. Mordecai, these are our people, our family, our future. And Morty tells me, it's no mistake that I was named queen. I must convince the king to stop this slaughter. But Morty, anyone who steps to the king without being summoned faces death. Um, look what happened to Queen Vashti. That night I lay restless. I look out the window and I remember. Hello, my name is Esther. And I am Jewish. I am so fierce. And I'm the queen. The next day I approach the king. I need to talk to you. I'm throwing a banquet tomorrow, and I want you and Haman to come. He agrees. Go, Esther. Go, Esther. Go, Esther. The banquet is awesome. Haman and the king are in the front row, and I stand in front of all the Persian guests. My dear king, it has been ordered that all the Jews are to be killed. That means that I am going to die too, for I am Jewish. I am standing up for what I believe in. If you believe that I shouldn't die and that my people shouldn't die, then you must stop this evil plan. The room went silent. Who would ever think of such a thing, the king cried. Him, I pointed, Haman. The king was furious. He stood up and bellowed, Let it be ordered across the land that no Jews are to be killed. Go, Esther! Go, Esther! Go, Esther! And wouldn't you know, my king flipped the script. Haman was hanged, and the Jews were saved. Always have the courage to stand up for what you believe in. Oh, and P.S. I started making these awesome cookies that are shaped like Haman's silly hat. They're selling like hotcakes. Who knew?